What is going on guys? Welcome to Greg Ols TV. In this video, I'm gonna do it again. I'm doing it earlier this time. I'm going to remove the screen protector that's on the large screen on the Galaxy Z Fold 4. It has a little screen protector, I'm gonna take it off. And the reason I'm gonna take it off so early is basically because I saw a tweet from Ice Universe and he said, trust me, peeling off the Fold 4 protective film will make the crease appear lighter, but do so with caution. So, I mean, okay, I think you can see it at that angle. The screen that I'm looking at is kind of small, but you can see it and it is ever so, you know, you can see it. You can see it right there, you can see it. So I'm curious if I take it off, is it gonna appear smaller and feel a little bit smaller? And that's what I'm gonna do. And plus, I know, you're, I get this question all the time. Can I take my screen protector off? Especially when it gets dirty or bubbles up. Yes, you can take it off. Your phone will work fine. It's not gonna break your phone. Um, it, it just protects against scratches. And even when, every time I've taken it off, I've never gotten a scratch. Now, I did have some stretch marks in it, on it, and that wasn't because I removed the screen protector, it's because it was opening and closing too much and the, the screen on the Z Fold 3 kind of had a, some kind of defect in it. But otherwise, no, this, it's not gonna break or anything, so chill out with that. You'll be fine. And plus, you probably have an insurance plan, or at least you should get an insurance plan. Anyways, here we go. I'm gonna peel it off, my screen's already dirty anyway. Here we go, one, here we go. I'm gonna lift my hand up so you can, it's already bubbling up a little bit. Look at that, it's peeling up. Oh, this one's extra sticky. Oh, wow. There we go. Oh, wow. Man, I'm not lying, this one's a lot harder to peel off than the, the other ones. I'm wondering if it's because Oh, gross. I always like to show that too. Look how gross that is. All the fingerprints and stuff, nasty. Hopefully you guys can see that. Whoa, nasty. But that's gone now. And here we go. Uh, well, let's see. I think he's, I think he's, I think Ice Universe might be fibbing a little bit. Cause I'll be honest with you, I can still see it. I'm gonna, oh. The living room is not responding. Not that I, not that I couldn't see it, but it's like, it looks the same to be honest with you. There's a good angle. Doesn't it look the same? Does it look less indented? That crease right there that goes up in the middle? I think it looks exactly the same. It might feel a little bit less. I don't know. It's definitely not like, if, if, it, if it is seemingly less, it's probably like 10% less. I wouldn't say it's like 50% less than it was with the screen protector on. So I would, it's a little dramatic of a statement. I'm not concerned that I took it off. Um, I'm still fine with it off. So if you wanna take yours off, take yours off. A lot of people are gonna say, no, don't take it off. It helps with scratches, it helps with this, it helps with that. Do whatever. You know, you can always buy another screen protector. They're all over the place, or you can even go to Samsung. It won't void your warranty either. A lot of people are gonna make up some stories like, Samsung won't, it's gonna void you. It doesn't void your warranty. I've taken it off every time, and every time I returned it to Samsung, they didn't say it voided my warranty. So don't listen to other people. There you guys go. Seems fine, works fine. Just to show, everything works fine. Look at that. Perfect. Galaxy Z Fold 4, screen protector off. If you wanna buy this, let me know. I'll ship it to you now. Peace.